The island of Sodor is surrounded by a beautiful blue sea. It has fields with green and sandy yellow beaches. There are rivers, streams and lots of trees where the birds sing. There are windmills and a coal mine and docks of visitors for the island arrive. The island also has lots and lots of railway lines. Who's that puffing down the track? It's Thomas! Hello Thomas! Hello everybody! Welcome to the island of Sodor! Boko's beautiful beach. Sodor is a very nice place to visit. All the steam engines and diesel engines work really hard. Boko is one of the diesels who worked on the island of Sodor for many years. One day, Boko discovered a beautiful beach that's never been found by the Fat Controller. It was a perfect sight. The sea was waving and the seagulls called across the sky. It was wonderful. One day the Fat Controller gathered all his engines for a good day's work. But Boko wasn't listening to a single word what he was saying. He was too busy thinking about the wonderful beach he saw yesterday. You are to collect coal trucks and bring them here, from the quarry, said the Fat Controller. But Boko couldn't hear him. But Boko didn't go to the quarry. He went to the beach instead. He couldn't think of any better place to be but here. So Bill and Ben brought the coal trucks to the station instead. Boko's meant to be doing this, said Bill. I wonder where he is, said Ben. I don't know, said Bill. He could be anywhere. We'd better find out what he's been up to recently, said Ben. Bill agreed, and they made a plan. The next day, the Fat Controller told Boko that he had to collect some passengers and take them to Brendam Docks to catch their ship. Boko was very glad that he got that job, and so he hummed away. But Bill and Ben had been watching Boko. Let's follow him, they said. So Boko was on his way to the beach, and Bill and Ben followed. Boko didn't take the passengers to Brendam Docks. He wanted to show them the beautiful beach instead. The passengers looked out of the window and went to explore the beach. They thought it was wonderful. Boko was having such good time showing the passengers the wonderful beach that he completely forgotten about the passengers had to be catching a ship at Brendam Docks. Bill and Ben saw where Boko went. Wait till we tell the Fat Controller, said Bill. He'll be very cross, said Ben, and then they puffed away. Back at Napford Station, the Fat Controller heard what Boko was up to. Take me there at once of the Fat Controller. So they climbed on board Bill and then they set off. Meanwhile, 
Boko's passengers are having a wonderful time when Boko heard a pair of familiar whistles. What are you doing here? asked Boko. The fat controller came out and walked up to Boko. He was just about to be very, very, very angry with Boko. But then the passenger said, Don't be angry with Boko. This is a wonderful beach. They said. The fat controller looked all around. And they were right. This is wonderful, he said. I've never th discovered this beach before on the island. We'd better advertise it for the holiday makers. And so it was arranged. All the holiday makers came to visit the beach. And Boko got to take all the holiday makers for a visit to the beach. They were having a wonderful time. This, said Boko to himself, is the best job I ever had!